Brinley and Carter, Uncle Lester needs kisses. Come on. Come on over here. I need kissy right here. Got their little arms Carter. Open. Thank you. Oh, I got a hug too. Come on, Brinley. Mm, yeah. Right. I love you, Carter. Bye. 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 See you later. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna put you down so you get your flip flop, okay? No. Well, what am I? How can I? How can I work like this? How can I work like this? How am I? How am I supposed to work like this? Seriously, I can't walk around and work with you on my shoulders because you're scared of a turkey. That's Al Davis. He's sweet. Those are sweet birds right there. I think you should love them. Well, how about you put? How about you get me? right over there and then get my flip-flop. How about I go down real low? No! Just hold on. No! I'm going for the flip-flop. No! I'm going for the flip-flop. Get it. <laughs> get it! You don't choke me out with your feet, Br Brinley. Get it! I'm trying. I can't reach it. Here, you get it now. I can't. I don't know. Get it, Brinley! Okay. Yeah! Put me down. <laughs> Put me back up. Okay. You, you went up or down? Up. Why? How am I supposed to get up? I'm on my knees. Get up. How am I supposed to get up? Get up. I have no strength. Get up. My legs don't work like that. Get up. Well, how, why do I have to get up? Why can't we just... Let, let me just lay on my back. Can I just lay down? Mm. If I just lay down, that'd be okay? No. Why? Okay. What are you scared of? Huh? Mm -hmm. Well, hold on. I'm laying there. Where are you going? Where are you running off? Now get up! <laughs> now get up! Joey, I'm coming! I'm trying to work here and I got Brinley bothered. Okay, I'm out. Now, the road, I can get up on the back. Uh, now you can get back up! Am I supposed to go up now? Yes. How am I supposed to work around here with you on my back, though? Seriously. Yep. How can a man work like this, baby? Can I take you back in the house? No. <laughs> I can't work holding you. You're choking me out. Okay. You are choking me. You good? No. I'm going to be to the house. Okay. Guess I'll do my work later. And if that you have to finish editing your video. Can someone come get this little girl? Lord. Because I'm probably, because I'm kind of a new Irish sanctuary I don't think the dog's going to bite you. Member. You're a new sanctuary member? Yeah. So you think the dog might bite you because you're a new sanctuary member? No, so I Dr. Cochran. All right, so Dr. Cochran has come over. Uh, she's not come to see our gay ducks. You do know that these two over here have a, yeah. Yeah, they're that. Flamboyant. No, uh, so I'm gonna, I can I don't want to video you and I say this because I don't know how you're going to react to this. But we have a poor female Muscovy duck mm -hmm. that ha has laid eggs after eggs after eggs. And none of them are fertile because those two only want to be with each other. Not her. It's a love is that the saddest? And that, is that the craziest thing ever? Oh, yeah. And so it's a... <laughs> That's a regular romance. You're going to holler really quick. Okay. <laughs> Everyone needs to settle down. We're not ready to feed yet. You got two hands, baby. Put them both to where you go. Work them both. Work both your hands. Come on. Uh-oh, now there's three horses. Okay. Now there's three. What about the donkey? You can't leave poor Ivy by herself. Hey, what about Voodoo and Bucky's? I don't have three hands, do I? Well, you got to use one foot and two hands. Or you can lick one of them. <laughs> one. Bigger one. That's good enough. So you love animals? Mm -hmm. And you can feed animals? You want a job? How much how much would you make me pay you every week? Uh, like five or one dollar. Five or either one dollar? Yes. Okay. Ask your mom if that if that if that'll work. Do we need one more? No. There is only one problem, though. You're scared of cornholio. How can you work here if you're scared of a turkey? Okay. Actually, I don't want a job. I just want you don't want a job? You just... I just want to get paid for helping. <laughs> you, she don't want a job. She just wants to get paid. Yeah. I, where have I heard that before?
Have you been drinking, young lady? No. You sure? Because the vet has all of her medicines right there. Uh -huh. She can give you a some so kind of a test. IV? Yeah. You need an IV. <laughs> Straighten that out. So she a uh, heartworm positive for sure, which we kind of weren't surprised about that. We're doing some blood work. That means all three of our rescues so far have been heartworm positives, Jamie. No surprises in that. <laughs> oh my lord. Could you could you put your shoe uh, your boot out a little bit further so he can just kind of have a look at him? He just wants to look at him. He just wants to look. All he wants to do is look. All right, say so your goodbyes. We got to go. Say so your goodbyes. Did you give a kiss? Oh, she loves you. Jesus, help me. Oh, God, just don't look at me. Bro. Okay, sheesh, Lord, mighty. Oh, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus, if I have to catch this bird, God, help me. Right here on my finger, little one. Lord Jesus. Okay, okay, everything's good. Whew, I'm safe. I'm safe. Oss? No. Alaska? Yeah. Where's she staying at? At your house? Yes, like at my dad's house. Do you like her? Yeah, she's really nice. She's nice? That's good. Yeah. What do you like the most about her? Um, she's sweet. She's sweet? And, uh, huh, that's pretty much all I know about her, but uh, she's sweet to my dad. Oh, she's good to your dad? Yeah. That's important. So, this little lady over here has come down to see the new rescue dog named Stella. And we're going to walk out now and love on her for a little bit. And uh, what do you like the most about the things I've told you about her? Or, what worries you the most? Or, what scares you the most? Or, what are you the most concerned about? Just say something. Okay. I'm going to say that she's really on the video since I saw her. She was cute. The one that's closed over here, yes. Over here on this side. Hey, you guys, this is not about y'all. Al, go away. Oh, hi, Stella. Look, I brought someone to visit you. What do you think, baby? Are you scared because of the turkeys? You scared of the turkeys? Hi, baby. Hi, pretty love. Are you scared of the turkeys or what? What's wrong? Who are you scared of? Which one are you scared of? Who are you scared of? Scared. I can't hear you. I'm scared. scared of who? I'm scared. Of who? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got him. I got him. Hold on. Are you videoing me? Yes. Oh, get him, get him, get him. Is it recording? Yes. All right, listen. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to burp him. Ready? No. Are you listening? <laughs> Just listen, listen. Just go. Listen. Just listen. Just Are get him and go. Okay, listen. What? Burp, corny. Here we go. go Did no. you hear him burp? Yes, but he's just running. Did you hear him? Yes. I want to tell you a story about a man. Humble is his way, he'd lend you a helping hand Who took the time to teach kids, that was his profession Plus drove the school bus when they completed all their lessons Single father or two, plus a coach could be a lot to juggle But not when you're working with that I'm a survivor muscle He took pride in the few animals he raised Hobby forming by night seems to balance out his days And he always knew that his best days were yet to come But didn't know first he had to make it through a storm Everybody's evacuating, leaving in a hurry There's trouble on the way, they name it Hurricane Harvey When you have little resources, not a whole lot of money 
It's hard to lock away and secure all of your belongings. So this man and his two boys packed and evacuated, waited for the storm to pass, and it was hard to have patience. Cause there were all sorts of rumors that spoke on how you needed a boat for the roads that we drove on. And animals are floating by, helpless and afraid. The storm was cataclysmic, left the town in a rage. The roads finally opened, and it was time to go see the damage that was done. He was kind of scared to proceed, but started down his driveway, water just above both feet. Pull out his phone to capture, moments later, guess what he seen? It was his little black pig named Patty, dashing his way like a lost child who found daddy. Emotions running high, he didn't know what to do, except cry tears of joy, and he ran toward her too. The little goat Meg was like the engine that could Because she never gave up And the horses, they were good See, the house was a wreck But all that could be fixed It really hurt to see Some got caught up in the fence Lost their life In that moment, he was taken out his element And then God came and gave him gifts That was heaven sent Admired how he tended to the animals and land Because that was the initial plan When he made man And so, he was placed on a whole new surface The same old land, but a whole new purpose And three months later, he was blessed with a wife Row front and center watching him rebuild his whole life. So remember this story when you think you have nothing. I'm a survivor sanctuary. We're all survivors of something.